Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to continue our playthrough of Dark Souls Remastered. I am going to grab that item right there first. And we're going to start off with a boss fight, because there's a boss at the very start of the Lost Isolith. And I guess I have to fall down there, huh? Jumping off, yeah, I guess it's right here, huh? And I miss. Oh no, I, I made it. So that is Solaire Sign. Let me go back up and hit that bonfire real quick. Um, so I can get my health back from that. So that's Solaire's Sign. Uh, we're gonna summon him just for chits and giggles because it's fun. I don't think he does any work during this fight. And also, um, whenever you summon somebody, whether it's an NPC or it's a human player, the boss has more health. I don't know if they do any more damage, but I think they have more health to scale with, with the more players. So it usually doesn't benefit you to summon someone that isn't going to help you. But I don't know. We're going to do it because it's fun. So we are going to put on the flame ring. Because there's a specific section that we're going to need it for right here. So this boss coming up is um, I, like a setting peak demon or something. I can think it's called. Um, it's basically sitting in a lake of lava. And there's not really anywhere to fight. So we're going to run around to the right side. And have to we're going to have to sprint through some lava. Good, I have that up. And so we're going to take a little bit of damage. But um, this right here is a really crappy place to fight it. So we're not going to fight it here. Yeah, we're going to sprint around to that right side and go over there. There he is. This guy isn't too bad. It's just he likes to sit in lava. And we can't find lava because he kills us. So um, he's not the end of the world, but he can be a pain. So we're gonna run this way. You can see how much damage that does. That's just that's just like half a second of lava. That's how much damage that does. Holy crap. I'm not even gonna pillage that. I'm just oops, that's not what I wanna do. And so Lair is running around like an idiot. He might actually die from this. Commercial Lair. Stop burning alive. Wait, why is it not taking any more damage? So, you want to lure this guy over here, because this is a better place to fight him. Ooh. Yeah, it's that boulder side sword just does a lot of damage, so that's what's nice about that. So yeah, we get the orange charred ring. So you guys saw how much damage we took earlier from that. Where is the orange charred ring at? There it is. Oh yeah, you know what? Oops, I don't want to do that. Uh, so it says reduces lava damage. So you saw we almost died. So let me heal again. So we're almost full health now. So we almost died running across this with the flame stove plate ring. If you run through this, look how little damage we're taking now. Look at that, we took almost no damage from that. That's the difference. 
And that is why um, I wanted to wait for this item so we could uh, go get those items back at the Demon Ruins. So let me see if there's a bonfire over here. I can't remember if there is or not. I think there is. And then we'll head back and get those items real quick. Yeah, look how little damage I'm taking. That's nothing. That would have killed me if, without that ring. See, those, there's Solaire. So if you find Solaire here first, and you talk to him first, he will find the Sunlight Maggot first. Why? After all this time? And then he'll be hollow, and you'll have to kill him. What? Oh. So we're going to hit this. We're going to warp back to uh, Daughter of Chaos. So let's go kill those Taurus Demons and get us ourselves uh, some items over there. So you can still go over there and get those items first, but you want the Flamestone Plate Ring. You want uh, armor that has... Oh, wow, really? So we need 2,000 more. You know, it's fine. Um, you want some armor that has some sort of uh, fire defense on it. And Flash Sweat also really helps. You stack all those together and you can run across the lava. But in my honest opinion, um, Lava Ring is just by far the best. Like, that's just... That is just the best thing to get. So we'll try to pull these guys out of here. We'll get us some items, and the reason I am coming over here because there is an item that might be useful to people. Um, I've never used it, but I know it's used for uh, certain builds, so I want to show you guys where it's at first. Otherwise, I would just skip like almost this whole thing because there's really nothing over here that I like um, that I ever need. So, but for the sake of completion, I will show you guys what's over here. So there's a ton of these stupid Taurus demons we have to fight. Um, you can cheese them with a bow. Like, you can literally just shoot them with a bow and they're not going to hurt you. But I will fight them for posterity's sake. Without the Ring of Fog, you can pull, like, two or three by accident. So, the bow does help. But with the Ring of Fog, I should be okay. We'll find out. See, what I hate about that is that it knocks me down. Like, I can't even attack. Ugh. And that still hit me too, and like, that, I, I was behind him. Like, what is this BS? why I cheese these guys. Because that's complete BS. There's no reason that guy should have been able to do that. Like, he's hitting me when I'm behind him. Like, how is that even possible? Yeah, I don't want to go over there. Just, just in case. No, 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 no. Oh, that still caught me. Yeah, I think we need to go over here too. So, we'll just pull all these guys. Are you kidding me? Okay, cool. I was like, there's no way. build really oh just cancel on yourself <laughs> oh dude great axe I hear that's the best uh, heavy weapon in the game I've been told before Okay, there's that. 
I think you can buy that from, um, I guess we should kill all these guys. I think you can buy that from, uh, Shiva, but I can't remember. Really? No, 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 no. Ah! Now I gotta heal. Not taking that any chances. Oh, 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 I dodged way too early right there. And somehow I still got him to hit. Another one. So, one more, and we can be done with this mess. That was too late. That was actually too early, and I still got away with it. That was too late, too. I need to heal now. Oh my god, that almost killed me. That still hit me. That's BS. Okay, so we're done with those guys. We have three items to get. Two, two items? Three items. Maybe three items. Oh, Bloodstain. I was like, what is that? Okay, so let's put our ring on so we don't die because I'd be pissed. Because these guys do respawn. Take some damage. Up here, what the heck? Jesus, get up there! Just a soul, not worth it, in my opinion. So, if you put on like those those gold hem robes that we got from the uh, Jesus discharge up there with the stone, the flame stone plate ring. And flash sweat, I usually die just getting out to that right there. Like, I can get to it and then I die. And I have to mash A to make sure that I get it in time. So, this is the item. It's not very far out. Chaos Slime Ember! So that gives you your Chaos uh, upgrades, Chaos Slime upgrades. Which is definitely base damage, so we don't want this anymore. And I'm going to hold my bone out of here so I don't have to deal with this again. Off we go. Let's level up again. So now the question is, can I warp back to that place? No, I cannot. Okay, that sucks. So we'll have to run back there. So I'm hoping I can ring a fog it. Um, the whole way, because there's some creatures that kind of suck that I don't want to deal with. But we might have to run through, through some lava, so I don't know. So we will go this way. I need that to break or get that way. Go, go. God dang it. And we're still human, which sucks. Because um, I've been invaded in Lost Isles before, and it sucks. I mean, invasions anywhere suck, but... So we'll heal here just because. Um, but I have successfully used the Ring of Fog to evade people because you can't see that well. And so if you hide up against a darker wall, sometimes you're just about invisible. So I have hid up against walls before and had people not be able to find me. Um, and then they just departed on their own. It was really fun. Uh, so anyways. So now we need Mr. Lava Ring. Yep, 
Yeah, we might need this guy, but I, I can't remember. Because Lost Isolith is, is mostly full of lava. There's a big section where there's not, but the first part is just nothing but lava, so. And we're going to see. So rest here again. See, now Solaire's gone. So now he's gonna be over uh, by that secret entrance that we unlocked. Yeah, you gotta run through lava, so. And I don't think there's any items around here. There are gonna be a few areas where we're gonna need to run through lava to grab items. So those guys right there are the guys I'm afraid of. Um, they don't aggro that easy, but I have had them aggro me. Uh, and I don't remember them being fun to fight, especially like on these little small paths. So I'm gonna hope for the best. But I don't really wanna fight them. They look, they look like bone T-Rexes or something to me. Ah, oh, I hate this. We have an item right here. Solo Brave Warrior. So, do we need to go right there? Yeah, we need to go right there. Crap. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. Because usually you don't have to run that far on the main path. Like just like waiting for it. Okay, nothing yet. Um, I know I I know I've aggroed one of these guys before. This guy, real guy. I also know one of these little temple things has a hidden wall on it. I don't remember which one, but one of them does. guys tend to be a little more red than those guys so you can tell a slightly dead oh crap don't go that way a slightly different texture on them you can kind of tell but not like extremely so i know over there somewhere there's an item i don't think it's right there i think it's farther up though yeah it's over there it's a divine blessing i usually skip that because i don't really need those i don't use those very often but I might try to go get it. But I, I know it's, it's a divine blessing, so it's nothing special. Oh, there's two items over there. I don't know what the other one is. Um, I need to go down. Too many manis, that's good. So how am I supposed to get down without getting killed? Just follow this, I guess, maybe? Um, yeah, kinda, I guess. That worked. So this is the, uh, hidden one with the bonfire. Like I was using Sanctus. He's got the Silver Knight set on, too. I don't know what sword that is. So there's our bonfire, so if we die, at least we can come back here. Just in case, I haven't done it for a while. And when I was farming uh, the Silver Knights for this shield, I my Baldur's side sword actually did break on me. So, and we're from doing like 150 damage to doing 36 damage, which is pretty significant. So, um, I heard an enemy over here. Uh oh. I'm 
Piss one up. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, what, did it kill something? Reset. Reset. We don't want that. We don't want anything to do with those guys. This one. Okay. Okay, so um, we're going to... Oh, there's another one, too. Sprint out there and try to get those. I think you have to go around this way. I think you're blocked off right there. So we're going to sprint over there and try to get this. We should be fine. Uh, this is when I wish I didn't use the ring of paper protection because I could fall ring and ring at the same time. But it requires a little staff investment, so. And the ring of favor protection is so nice. We have the divine blessing. And a divine blessing too. Um, because it gives you 20% to HP, stamina, and a quick load. And that, that's just really, really nice. Alright, we're good. We're good. So that's all the items that I know of around here. I might be missing one, but I don't think so. Let's just go this way, whatever. So now we want to go up there. So we're gonna go back here. And rest up. But I think all that's blocked off, so I don't think there's any, anything else we can do. So then we gotta run over here. Here. Okay, so now we can take off the ring, the orange ring, because we don't need, we won't be in lava anymore. That's the end of the lava. All right. All right, so sorry for the pause, guys. I have a cat who likes to open up doors, and he opened up the screen door because he's an able. So this is kind of the main part of the last Lost Isolith. I don't think there's anything up here. Um, we're still gonna face people who like to do fire. I don't know if they're resistant or not. I, I don't wanna risk it. The Ring of Fog is gonna come in super handy around here. Cause there's a lot of these guys hiding around the corner. Corners. I don't know if I all need the bow here. I don't, I don't remember using the bow here. See, so look like this. Like, you run right by, you don't see him, boom, torch to the back. See, it's floating though, and it's like weaving back and forth. I don't like that. I heard one of those guys. I think he's up there. Is he up there? Is he up there? I don't know. Anyways. Come in here. They're sitting all over the place here. Nope. Missed my stab. Yep. If you're in doubt, tap target. Or uh, auto lock, whatever you want to call it. I guess tap target's a PC term. Look at that hiding behind a pillar. Shameless. Shameless stuff. I thought it wouldn't let me lock onto that guy. See that? Yeah, that guy looks a lot darker. There's like a like a temple. It's like a te somewhere a temple, temple thing. Hey, look at that guy. That's a new guy. Yeah, I don't think there's anything back here. Oh, there is. More souls! Dude, I got a whole ton of those now. We're gonna have to spend them all. Usually I save them just in case I, I'm low on souls and I need a bunch, or if I'm just 
like a few thousand from a level up or something, but I, don't know, I guess we'll see. So these guys kind of suck. They're, I don't remember them being that difficult, but they kind of suck. They like to eat you. They pick you up and put you in that little head right there. Oh, I guess you can see. Yeah, kind of. Um, and they like grind you up and I think it killed you. I'm pretty sure it's like a one shot kill. But at our health, maybe not, but I know it really messes you up. So we want to go that way. But real quick, we're going to go this way. That's the one I heard that I couldn't find. So let's go over here real fast. I don't think there's anything over here. Oh no, there's a few I heard. There's an item right there, which we'll get in a second. There's the soul. I don't remember there being anything like really spectacularly good. Woohoo! No! Dang it. I tried to pillage it before it sent me backwards. We'll try it again. Yeah, I don't remember there being anything like really good around here. So. Um, I think. I think there's another NPC invasion in here. Maybe it's Kirk again. I can't remember. Okay. Where does that go? Oh, I know where that goes. We'll go that way in, in a second. We're not going to go all the way that way. But I will show you guys something. Okay, let's see if we can get this thing now. I just want to see if I can just fall right there like that. No, 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 no. Oh, I, oh, I can't. Okay, cool. Ooh, a rare ring of sacrifice. Cool. That's cool. All right. I'm gonna. We're gonna have to pop one of those. There is a point in the game where it's kind of necessary to have one. It's not 100% necessary, but there is a point in the game where you have to die. Like you don't have a choice. You have to die. So um, that's where it's nice to have a ring of sacrifice. Okay, so, uh, I'm gonna heal real quick. We don't need the bow. No, not that. No, dang it. Hit the wrong buttons. Um, so there's a guy right here we have to fight, and I do believe we're gonna get invaded by a NPC as well. This guy's a pyromancer, he kinda sucks to fight. No, 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 no. That's why he sucks in the fight. Still got you. Hurt. Suck it. Yeah, we got him. So that's the third Kirk invasion. If we would have killed him... Wow, we got 26,000 for killing him? Um, if we would have killed him in the depths, we would be able to get his armor set. Okay, Eyes of the Catalyst. So the Eyes of the Catalyst, I think, is one of the best Catalysts in the game, if I remember correctly. There's, like, two or three that are really good. There's that one... There's one you get from saving, um, God, I can't remember her name now. The Oilisil chick that, from the DLC we haven't got to yet. And then you get one at the end of Logan's, Big Cat Logan's quest line. Uh, the Logan one's really good because it, uh, it halves your casting, but it, like, doubles your damage. So, not a mimic. Pyromancy, cast fire whip. Okay, so we are at the boss. Well, yeah, we're at the boss, but let's let's do that one section real quick. I forgot about it. I said we were going to do it, and I forgot. Um, this is, like, the boss. So that is one of the bosses I hate the most in the game. This boss sucks. Um, there's a few tricks you can do. We're, there's one specific trick we're going to do. But we'll go down this way real quick. Because um, there's something I was going to... Oh, you know what? Ooh, Okay. There's a section we might have to miss. There's a storyline I was supposed to do and I forgot to do it. So we... Uh, nah, screw it. It's fine. 
It's Siegfried's. It, it doesn't give a good um, reward, so. So we're just gonna kill these guys real quick. Okay, so this right here, there is a Titanite Demon back here. This is the very last one in the game that you find. It's the only one that actually respawns. All the other ones, you kill them once and they die. The very end of that path back there is where we were at to get the Sunlight Maggot. That's where the secret entrance is. So if you come through the secret entrance, you come this way. You, come, you have to either kill him or run by him, and you end up coming this way. Uh... And then you'll run up that way and you're at the boss. That's why this is supposed to be the faster route. That's why it's the... the I don't know if it's called secret entrance. Um, this part right here collapses on you when, you when you go over here. Like, it looks like there was an item right here. This whole thing will collapse. So if you go see Siegfried in Blighttown, um, you will find him here. We didn't do that. I'm about, I'm about to try to kill the boss, too, so we might miss that part. Uh... Part of me wants to go do it. Part of me wants to go talk to him and then come back. So um, maybe we'll do that. Yeah, maybe we'll do that. And then we'll come back here and do this section. Because I don't really want to skip everything, honestly. I don't like skipping things on the re YouTube recordings. So, And then we'll go fight the boss. Because we're already at like 30 minutes right now. So um, we will use a... I just need to warp to the Dark Art Chaos because there's just nowhere else to go. Let's spend our souls anyways because it's probably better to spend our souls. We'll get that guy to 30 and then we'll get our endurance up. Okay, so we want to go back this way. So I'm going to not put the poison ring on. And just deal with it. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna put. Um, yeah, we got like 15 of those. I'm gonna put that on and just pop one. Not, I'm not that worried about it. Cause I don't want to aggro those boulder chucking ogre guys. So let's go take a look at this, just for the sake of completion. Uh, I don't usually follow the quest lines cause they don't really get good rewards. And there's, there's only one that I really worry about. It's um, Rhea's. And even then, sometimes I don't do it because it's more of a faith thing. But hers is like the light last of the quest lines. But we'll do Siegfried's for just because we can. We'll see if uh, Quilon is here yet, too. I'll see if I can explain that. Let's just see. So we're going to go around this guy. Yeah, she's there. Cool. So, um, if you have a uh, Pyromancy Flame that's plus 10, Yeah, now though. What? Um, if you have a pyromancy flame that's plus ten or higher, plus fifteen is where it maxes out, and then you ascend it. Uh, Quilana will show up. So let's talk to Quilana. Hmm. A mere undead. Yet you I am Quilana of Isolith. I am not often revealed to walkers of flesh. Are you too one who seeks my pyromancy, like Salomon? I don't know who Solomon is. Yes, of course. Very well. But to pursue my pirate, are you prepared? Oh, uh, yeah, sure, whatever. So she sells some of the stronger pyromancies. Nothing chaos-wise, which is usually the better ones. But she sells all kinds of cool stuff, I guess. And she'll also um, level up your pyromancy flame some more. 
Um, that's all I really want to do. Well, yeah, but do not. Uh, she is Laurentis's uh, uh, master, and like I said, she will only show up um, if you have a, a plus ten at minimum plus ten pyromancy flame. And as far as Laurentis, I think I told you guys already that uh, if you have a chaos spell, a chaos pyromancy, and you talk to him, where is he at? Um, he will want to know where he got it from, and if you tell him, he will come down here looking for it, and he'll turn hollow, and you'll have to kill him. So you'll lose him as a, um, as a uh, trainer, which also means you can't level up your pyromancy anymore. I think he's way the hell over here, I'm, I don't remember correctly. Damn it. Um, if you get a plus 10, at least you'll have Kubana left. She'll always be there. And that egghead guy, oh, there he is, will always be there as well. But, uh, Laurentis is the only one that sells Flash Sweat. And Flash Sweat is really good for... Would you please not do that? Uh, Flash Wet's good for if you want to grab that Chaos Ember. Otherwise, I, like, never use it, honestly. Alright, let's get over to, um... Sigmire here. Sigfried, Sigmire, I can't remember the names. Keep talking to him. Excuse me, I was... You see, I've made it this far. Um, by my... But can you... So we give him three, which is fine. Gives you the pierce shield, which is not that good. I think that's it. So we will homeward bone out of here. I guess I probably shouldn't have rested at that bonfire. I probably should have just kept going. But it's fine. So now we gotta head all the way back. Oh no, never mind. We don't have to head all the way back. What am I doing? We can warp. Yeah. And yeah. I don't see where we want to go. Okay, cool. We can warp. And uh, you guys see the abyss on there? It's one of the warp points. Never ever warp there because you'll die. <laughs> Without the that ring on. Like, you'll die. So don't do that. Okay. So we're going to take the shortcut back now, which means we're going to have to run by that stupid Titanite demon. And I almost always get hit by him at least once, so... So when we die from the boss, because we are going to die, because that's the way the boss works, um, this is the shortcut we're going to take. We're going to go this way, take a little bit of damage, because I oh well. And then head this way and take the shortcut. So this shortcut, once you unlock it once, it stays permanently unlocked, even if you leave the covenant, so it's not a big deal. Um, so Lair should be down here now. If you hadn't got the Sunlight Maggot before, he'll be hollowed and you'll have to kill him. Um, we did get it, so he should be fine. There he is. Was it all a lie? Oh, I give my son. I think that's it. I don't think it's that toxic. Thing. It yeah. My... And we're gonna move on. So I don't know if the Ring of Fog is gonna help us here or not. Regardless, we're gonna have to get close to him and run by him, so. So that's what we're gonna do. That's what I mean. That's what he does. It 
and he's still aggroing us. He will also throw lightning at us, too, by the way. So, um... Try to, you know, zigzag so you don't get hit by it. Okay, so now... Um, we can go do, do the school section, and then we're probably gonna call it. This video's getting kind of long. Alright, so we're gonna walk over here. This is gonna crumble on us. Oh, well, it would have made us fall if we didn't step right there. Be where I fall, yeah, so... I, I guess I'll just drop down there. Yeah, I'll just drop down. It's fine. So, I don't think there's any enemies up here, but you'll see Solaire, or Solaire, uh, Sigrid over there. Or Sigmire. I can always position her. We need to get over to him. So, I believe if we didn't um, talk to him, I don't think he would be here. I think if we beat the boss, I don't think he'd be here either, so I didn't want to mess up his quest line. Normally, I don't care, because it's his rewards kind of suck. So what's going to happen here is when we talk to him, he's going to want to go down there and fight those guys. If he dies, the quest is over. You get a crappy reward. If you kill them all before you talk to him, his quest line ends. You get a crappy reward. If you leave one alive, um, you can drop down there, kill it, and then you get the best reward. And his quest line actually continues. So we're going to pull out a bow. We're going to cheese some of these guys because they're a pain in the ass. You want to leave at least one alive. Can I aim? No. Oh, I know why. Because I'm dumb. And the reason I'm doing this is because, number one, uh, this, that down there might be poison. I can't remember off the top of my head. I think it's poison. But also, number two, when you talk to him and he goes down there... He, he can die really quick. So you uh, want to try to thin him out as much as possible so he doesn't die. So we're going to kill this one. I think there's one more after this. But we're going to just say screw it. It's fine. Just in case there isn't one. I think there's one below us. So let's talk to him. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. Don't do it, Sigmar. Okay, that's fine. Oh, we took a hell of a hit right there. Our tiny chunk. Okay, so we'll go through here. Our tiny chunk. Our tiny chunks. I believe these are for the fire weapons. If you do like the fire path, you need red tiny chunks. I know for um, enchantment for the, the magic, you need. Uh, Oh my god, there's a fly in here. You need um, blue tonight chunks. Oh my god, I hate flies so much. So, I think there might be more. Don't fall down there, because I think you die. I don't remember there being a, a lower area here. So, let's run around. Make sure we got everything. Oh my god, can no more ring of fog. We're gonna do this. 
that, so we don't have to worry about going slow in this stupid muck. I don't care if I aggro those big guys. We can kill them. Yeah, look around. I know there's some items down here. That one, I believe, is on a mimic. Ooh, a red tad night slab. So the colored slabs are finite. Nothing in the game drops those. So you can only make so many of the uh, other path weapons. But uh, I do believe Titanite slabs, the normal ones, drop in the game, I believe, from somebody. So those I think you can do more of, but I could be wrong. We'll roll our way around. This is the way up. I think that was everything. I don't think there was anything else that I missed. So, I'm gonna call it good. Sigmire's just gonna hang out there in the friggin' poison, apparently. Kill that guy. Get some more Ritani chunks. So to get out of here, I believe there is a tree branch we need to get on. Which I'm gonna think it's this. I'm gonna assume it's this one over here. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. We'll find out. No, it's that one over there. I think. Ah. I think I fell from the wrong spot. Crap. Well, that's not good. I don't want to fall back down again because it hurts. And it. Okay. Um, yeah. I just trapped myself again. Well, off we go. That is annoying. I'm gonna have to heal. I always try not to use those, but I guess it's fine. Okay, so we wanna go that way. Okay, so you're forced to go this way it looks like. Okay, yeah. So we got everything down here. I will try not to do that again. That was the chest. That. That's a dead end. This goes this way. That goes that way. Poison. Because I believe we want to go back here. I, I'm pretty sure, but let's. Start back down on this guy. Don't go that way again. Yeah, so this doesn't go anywhere. Okay. So we want to go this way. This is where we fell through. Come over here.
And then that's when we can make it, but don't get swept, basically. Do not get swept. Because that's probably how we're going to die. Oh my god. No, 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 no. Woo. I hate those. Wait for that little walk guy. There we go. Wait for that. Run up. Hit us, sucks, heal. Sweet, slam, okay, run, 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 run. Oh, we, we, we landed it, go, 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 go. Oh, we made it, boys, we did it, we did it, hell yeah. See, that's all you gotta do, sometimes you just need RNG to be in your favor, there you up. So I apologize for this video being so long. Maybe I can speed it up. I don't know. See what I mean? Those fire things are right down here too. That's BS. He could have killed us right there. Wham. But no, he didn't. Suck it. I would have been so mad if I died right there. I would have been like legit mad. Sixty thousand souls for that. How many arrows do I have? A lot, a little. Uh, I think we're okay on arrows still. I, I don't think we need to buy anything else. So we can up once. Um, we can use some souls though. We need what thirty-three. a little bit. So yeah, I apologize this video was so long. Um, but hopefully it was worth it. I think we just need one more. How many is this? Yep. Okay, we are almost at about max. So we will warp. So we're going to warp to Anna Rolando. Because now we're going to do the, um, 
Well, I shouldn't say that. I need to go farm up some more mana now. How many do we have? Not enough, probably. Uh, seven. Yeah. Okay. So I will go farm some more humanity, get us back up to 10, because we're going to use the, uh... Now we can use Quilax Fury Surf for the rest of the game. We're set. So anyways, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. I apologize for the video so long, and um, I'll see you guys next time.